How did Cal State LA help you become the inspiring champion you are today? Well, Cal State uh, LA really inspired me because, first of all, Dr. Joan Johnson and uh, Scotty Deeds had the men and women practice together from two to five every single day. And that was inspirational for us because we had the best competition because of that. Um, also, when I was here at Cal State LA, I started dreaming even in a more specific way what I want to do for tennis and also to fight for equal uh, rights and opportunities for men and women. And I had already made up my mind at 12 years old to do that. And it really enhanced, the environment here really enhanced, uh, it helped me get new ideas, to have better understanding of others um, because of the different cultures we have. Uh, and all those things are really important for my uh, growing up and getting more and more mature before I went to try to be number one in the world. Uh, because I was, I was still going to college and university, and then I would go play. So I had to finally give it up after three years here to go on to try to be number one. I went to Australia. But this laid the groundwork uh, for me to achieve my goals. I got great competition. I had great professors, although I really didn't go to class that much. I'd like to go down. <laughs> and, but I learned from others. I love learning. I listen to professors. I listen to the other students, the other uh, the administrators were fantastic. So all these experiences here I had at Cal State you know, really helped enrich my life and helped me to grow in my thinking. And when I finally got to travel globally to try to help change things, it, it, it was really helpful. Do you have any words to live by or wisdom you would like to share with current Cal State LA students? Well, lately when I've been giving commencement speeches um, to graduates, I've come up with three things I've observed through the years, um, now that I'm a lot older, I've seen a lot more. Uh, and there's three things that I think are really important. People who have inner and outer success, I find there's three things. Relationships are everything. Keep learning and keep learning how to learn and be a problem solver. And I find those three things have helped people have inner and outer success.